An invasive species of mosquito has been found in 13 countries in the EU, including France, Spain and Greece, with experts saying their discovery is linked to a rise in dengue fever, with locally acquired infections in Europe almost doubling to 130 last year. Authorities have been monitoring their spread as far north as Paris, where the Olympic Games will take place at the end of July. Our health reporter, Philippa Roxby, is following this story. They're pointing at a mosquito, a particularly invasive species of mosquito called the, called the Asian tiger mosquito. And it's, it's normally found in parts of Asia and Africa and brings disease with it like dengue fever and Zika virus. But in the past 10 years, that mosquito has been pushing further into, into Europe because of, experts say, because of climate change, creating very favourable conditions, humid, warm conditions for the mosquito. And so it's pushing further north into France and Germany and northern regions of those countries. It's also been found in the Netherlands and, and Belgium too. And it's bringing with it the risk of dengue fever, um, which can be very serious. For most people, uh, they get flu-like symptoms, but it can be serious and can also be fatal. And they're slightly worried that there's worsening, those worsening figures, worsening spread and that 2024 could be an even worse year than they've seen so far. What can be done to prevent the spread? How can you try to avoid being bitten in the first place? Yeah, it's, it's difficult, but mostly it's about using mosquito nets um, and it's using repellent to protect against uh, being bitten. Um, and in places like Paris, where they're expecting hundreds of thousands, potentially millions of visitors and athletes coming this summer, it's also about finding the breeding grounds where these mosquitoes are laying their eggs and stopping that happening too. So there's a big move to try and raise awareness among the public about the fact that these mosquitoes can bite and can transmit disease, and also to find out a bit more about where they're, where they're hiding in, in parts of Europe. Our health reporter, Philippa Roxby.